three years later after a deployment. And um, so it's just a very special thing. What a wonderful crowd. I was told there was going to be 30 people here. So this is more like a few hundred almost. So, so anyway, on behalf of everyone, I just wanted to uh, say thank you for coming. It is an honor to be able to do this um, and a special thing. It's wonderful to have a flagpole in front of your home because when you see that flag flying, that's why we serve and that's why we deploy, you know, to defend our nation's freedom. And so we're bringing it back home. So join me as we pray and ask God's blessings on this event. God, we have gathered to invoke your blessings on today's event and especially this next chapter in the Corcoran's families', families lives. This flag ceremony is truly fitting and symbolic of a family and soldier of Patrick, Sergeant Major Patrick Corcoran that has a career in serving his country and defending our nation, all the way from locations like Tangy Valley and Wardak Province, Afghanistan. From an IED in 2009 to a medevac back home, countless surgeries and rehab, God, I thank you for the courage, strength, and perseverance you have given this family that is standing before all of us today. God, I lift up all those people, businesses, and organizations who's made this moment possible. And finally, we remember our fellow soldiers still serving and fighting this very moment far away, fulfilling the commander's intent and making a difference in each and every mission. God, being here today is a blessing and a miracle, and I thank you for saving Sergeant Major Patrick Corcoran, a former neighbor, my friend, my operations Sergeant Major, a father, a husband, a model soldier, and an army ranger. In the book of Numbers, God's blessing to his people is especially fitting for this family today. And I read from the book of Numbers, verses 24 to 26, and it says, May the Lord bless you and keep you. May the Lord make his face to shine upon you and be gracious to you. The Lord lift up his countenance upon you, and may he give you peace. Amen. Thank you, Chaplain. The flag raising of the ceremony will be, be uh, conducted next, and the U University of Central Florida ROTC unit will be, be raising the colors. Colors, post. Yeah, if you can move on this side of the sidewalk, please. Thank you. If you hold your hand over your heart when the colors go up. The monument that's being dedicated is in memory of the fallen who served with Sergeant Major Corcoran during the deployment. Staff Sergeant Missile Pilafinia Hernandez. Sergeant Harley Lee. Staff Sergeant Jeffrey Hall. Specialist Matthew Ogden. Sergeant Jasper Obacanano. Sergeant Jerry Evans. Specialist Daniel Cox, Sergeant Terry Lynch, Sergeant Aaron Smith, Specialist Joshua Ferris, Private First Class Matthew Wilson, Specialist 
Justin Pellerin, Staff Sergeant Nickel Allen, the men of the 2nd Battalion, 87th F3. We overcome men and mountains.